For most people who have children, they are given the title of being a parent as soon as their child is birthed. For me, my mom was given the title as my parent the moment she signed the adoption papers. I often think about the amazing opportunity she gave my siblings and I to start a new life with people we could call family. She raised us when our biological parents were not fit enough. For that, I am very thankful. I would like to consider the source in Buena Park my happy place. When I am there, I feel like it's a way to balance any stress that I may be having. By being surrounded by things that give me comfort, such as K-pop food and stores of different cultures, such as Korean, Chinese, Japanese, and Vietnamese stuff. By going there, it's nice to see the environment of the place, which is very calming and informative. My mom is an inspiration to me because when she was younger, she went through many things that most kids shouldn't go through. Now, as she's grown up, she's managed to forgive them, as in the people who hurt her, in order to move on with life. That's one of the main lessons she's taught me, that in order to move on, you need to be able to forgive yourself and other people for mistakes. No matter what, she has always been giving and understanding and tried her best to help people. That's why I think she's such an inspiration. In life, there's definitely going to be some hardships and conflicts that people may have to deal with. And depending on how the person deals with it, some get over it and some don't. Recently, one of my hardships was I went through a breakup a couple months back. I was in a very negative state of mind. and I grew from it. I moved on. And I think that it's just a lesson in life that when life throws like rocks or conflicts in your way don't ever give up because there's always a positive thing in the end of it when i was younger my mom compared me to many kids one of them being my cousin ariana she was both academically smart and socially involved two things which i am not and i struggle with both it impacted me a lot because when my mom used to compare me, she was basically saying that I was not good enough and I'm not who she wanted to be. So I struggled finding who I was. And I guess, I guess the lesson is that you can't be anyone else. One of my personal dreams is, is to become a social worker. And in order to achieve that, like many other people achieve their dreams, I have to work for it. I have to be dedicated and I have to try my best in order to succeed.